Anyways, come home and wake, sleep and wake up the next day. They're on the phone, talk to Renee, they're on the toilet, I pee. So I said, Renee, we feel like a tampon come out. So, so Renee said, Sure, but you can't bring it on the screen. Look at the tampon you're talking about. I said, Your sister have sense the world don't need to hear the details, you already get the point. So um you youth, where you the pan like mom black the youth? Come on. I'm gonna want to fit this the youth and the night. If you don't want to hear it, you're not going um you boy, I didn't invite you over here. I came to tell the people what happened if you don't want to hear leave or shut up. Anyways. The baby had come down. Me never know say. Ah, the baby. Me up on the phone and talk to Renee. I said to Renee, Renee, how much time come with Renee? Say, but sure. What kind of time you talk about? I am not see period. I'm say shit. Renee, I chew. I said Renee, I'm so cold, but I call my mother. I call my mother. I say, mommy, you know, say it look like the baby had come. My mother said, what? She said, what I say? I'm say, looking at the toilet, I'm say, slime. She said, slime? She said, call, it, call your boyfriend. No, 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 I got to sit down. Call him, I'm say, yes. My mother said, if you come to doctor, no, 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 I'm gone. It look like something wrong with the baby. I feel like the baby has come down. Listen. That was one of the scary. I'm gonna tell you this. Me, I want strong girl. Ask my friend them. Nothing to make me cry easily. Believe in me. Believe in me. I start cry come and say I can't be a bit this. I could me because remember, you know, the first three months of your pregnancy, you know, feel connected to the baby. Like when I reach five months when the baby start they start feeling my move around. So at that time you know see you're really pregnant. Because even though you see a belly a grow and you see everything, you now know see you're really pregnant until you feel the baby a move. You believe me? When the baby start moving, I get so attached to the baby like my just how weird thing come out. Listen to me, so I'm gonna doctor. Boyfriend rush me reach quick, less than three. Because my boyfriend said, and then I knew me quick, quick in there. I will go to the doctor. And the doctor come and say, How you feel now? I tell her how I feel. She will do a urine test. But within the urine test, they realize things that mean. We're we not going to know. They're not going to know. And she said, Come, no, 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 something right. You see, by the time the woman put me on the bed and lift up so, and go so, the woman don't even put her finger up there. She said, No, no, no. Go to you, we are we in the right right now. So I say, Doctor, what happened? She never want to tell me. So I say, You can tell me, man. She said, Sweetheart, I really don't want to tell you this. I say, No, man, you can't tell me, man. She said, Yeah, I lose the baby. Listen to me. Me was as I'm not even say words because I'm still strong. Me is a strong piece of gal. I'm mean, gonna think nothing could have break me. Ask my friend then I lose man, I lose friend, I lose family when I chat to face I'm gonna talk about them dead. Lose as in you want to talk. You get what me I say? I lose them and it never hit me as hard as this hit me. You believe me? This, but 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 they don't explain the feeling to know. But it's a feeling where we can't explain to nobody. The thing bury me. The thing bury yo. I couldn't even move out for the bed for God the doctor, and it's urgent. Then you take the baby out of like right right now. I'm a cool mover for the baby. It's coming like my woman before and I'm just a ball. Come and say, God, you're wicked to me, man. I let me say, no. I let me 
like when people say you for question girl and I'm saying not true. But when I care my I for question and say why me? What everybody else in the world? After you know I'm so excited, me will love people so my boy, my boy, my boy. You say come off guy your way. Rush guy your way. The whole time the woman have come with me in a she put them put me in the wheelchair because I forgot emergency. Cause the baby literally they don't in a vagina. Because as I tell you somebody they put tell it and me a push at the baby that come meeting a tampon. Anyways when we reach you know my dad they put me on the bed and I talk to the doctor and everything and at that point I don't even care, I don't care what happened to me. Nothing. But I just feel sad, I just have a ball, I just have a ball. Because I said, God, I could have put a joy in my life and I stick to just so. Just so. No one in there, you could even give me a sign to say something go wrong or something make the doctor them try to save the baby or something. No. Hmm? Nothing. Anyway, I got you away and they run them tests and do all kind of something. And they said I'm going to try to see if they can save the baby. If the baby reach 24 weeks, if the baby reach 24 weeks, they can save the baby. Unfortunately, I wrote them camera, ultrasound room, PP test, blood test, all kind of tests in my room for me. The baby did too young. The baby was 20 weeks. Because at this point, they said I'm going to try to figure out if they can save the baby, I start to feel better. Because I said maybe there is a chance of saving the baby, you know? So my, start, my spirit start kind of lift up a little bit. I mean, I said, I don't want to ball, ball too much for the doctor. They said, I can't cry, cry. I'm running blood pressure. I said, doctor, oh, if you tell me, I said, I'm going to cry, cry. Doctor, you cannot tell me that. And the only way I'm going to feel better, I said, doctor, I'm strong, but God break me. The baby break me. Doctor, I cannot tell you the truth. I cannot hold it in my half a ball. My ball, my ball, my ball, my ball. I don't know if I'm going to go to My ball. The whole of my friends are coming. The whole of my family are coming. Everybody are coming. I come like. I'm afraid I'm going to share my phone. I don't want nobody to call me. I don't want nobody to talk to me. No. It's like my blackout. I mean, I say. Really, me, this is what I do. So God just bless me. So I'm just. I tell you the truth. That's all I could think about. God just bless me. So I'm just down with the baby. Just so boops. Anyway, the doctor then for me, this nice doctor man on there and start, you know, explain two things to me and say, I'm going to try to save the baby if the baby is 24 weeks. I said, all right, doctor, thanks. I start feeling a little better. When you do the test and everything, they say, no, they can't save the baby. So we have to come to a decision. What we're going to do? I said, all right, they have to know by your money because if they take out the baby by your money, me can lose my life because apparently from the time when the baby apparently the time when me didn't have a shop and I take my pee pee up myself I my water break and I never know so all of them time they the baby down in my vagina all of them time they half way in my vagina half way in my cervix you understand what I say? dangerous could have killed me I don't know serious things the baby all right I'm a doctor and doctor say the baby good nothing to do me. And the doctor tell me the baby good and nothing to do me. Anyway, then I know don't know you and I can't do for them as it is. They say, well, I have to make a decision, you know, because it's the baby or me. And I say, babes, I know you love the baby and you want to save the baby, but saving the baby, I got to put it in too much risk. You can't have baby again. So baby's in a short we can't breathe again. I'm gonna want to lick my baby, my mom, my baby. I'm just gonna put the phone stop. I'm just about to place. I mean I say father God really there's nothing we can do for see the baby. May we spend it. I don't know what happened, my phone just shut down. I don't know what, I just shut right off. Anyways, back to what I'm saying. 
But then I talk to baby father and I say, babes, I don't know what to go about. They say it's either the baby or me. And him not hesitate. Same time, I say, babes, are you? I don't want to tell you, you love the baby and the two love the baby. But at the same time, we can't have baby again. You understand? I say, babes, are you sure so we can't have baby again? I say, yeah. I'm sure so we can't have baby again. Just don't make that make me lose you. I say, all right. I call the doctor. I say, doctor, baby father say you can take the baby. And the next day, them come. They say, I'm going to give me the injection because the baby, I'm going to push out the baby. Listen, my man. I want to think for easy like I lose the baby, you know. But it's another for you push out a baby, know him say the baby not alive when him come out. A that lick right or so. It lick yes so. Believe that me? When me hear them say the baby I will come out with another life, me say that uh, don't say that. Don't I give me the injection and he come like them can't give me the injection because my blood pressure gone we have to hold me a ball and say if I calm down I have to calm down they might tell everybody to try to calm me down everything they might give me pain killer everything for calm me down and no one calm me down because I say I have to push up baby and the baby that got life this is not the thing that I said I'm going to swap but I'm weak. I'm weak. I mean, so far I got all oh, push up baby. And the baby now good. First of all, you have push up baby. You don't want to know, so you have push up baby and baby. Good. You have to hear baby cry and baby have come home with you. You get what I'm saying? That you have to live. That you want to see. Anyways, I'm coming out of if I try to calm down because I definitely know say if they might do the procedure today, I'm not going to live. Anyway, I'm going to calm down a little bit and then give me the injection. About 10 minutes into getting the injection, me no wish them pain, yeah? pan, nobody. Cool to everybody that is a mother. You guys are very strong. But my tell you when them give me the injection for send on pain for, for the pain cured on the baby. It come like period pain in a hundred percent effect. But see me does have ba my ball, my under pain, my under some different I don't know I'm mean, not talk physical pain. The pain is, I think, at the maximum level of pain. That them give me the strongest painkiller, and the painkiller with them give me now the nothing for me. You believe me? The painkiller with them give me now the nothing, nothing for me. I'm gonna take the painkiller. I'm gonna just in the six. I'm gonna say I go to seven hours under the pain. Because the baby now come out and he might fight, you know. Because him in there and in my life because he might move. But the only thing is, him halfway in his home, halfway up in our cervix. There's no way them can save him. The baby alive up until him come out. So you know that? Fuck with my mentality, man. Can be there was a fighter. He was a fighter. Strong, strong fighter. He was alive. Until him come out, because when we get injection, him still a move. He start move all worse. He start kick me and something. But five hours going to six hours at the at the injection, the pain start get worse. Cause him start move now. Him start come now in my vagina, fully. The whole place start get black. Start ball of the nurse. I said, Nurse, you have to come blood clots even me, and you're dead. 
pasal nak sakit hamat dia pasal nak ka mating mating ka dia dengan dia ka fus me evasi the wall fucking room lagi black the wall room start lagi black kalau baby aku mau tak mian saya fuck father god pasal father god I'm sorry my question is at this point I think I did come and say I have did me I did the whole fucking room start get black and I start black and I start get weak but I can't get weak now because this is the time for me to push the doctor the nurse start saying I have to push I say nurse I have black and I say nurse I did it I can't block that I did it I can't I start ball I say nurse I'm gonna start get weak and weak and the whole room start get black you see by the time of who just let go and give up the baby come out and the whole place just it's like my life just come back in on me the whole of my life just come back in on me one go I mean I say fuck thank you God I'm gonna start praying I'm gonna start praying I'm gonna say thank you Jesus and then take out the baby the baby slide out because I have to push I have to do one hour push and my last strength I have to push out the baby you believe in me? the last strength I have in me The last strength I'm having to push up my baby with. I'm sitting and I'm saying, God, you know this. But right now, I'm going to believe in you. Because for me, why is a girl of God fearing? Because I'm telling you, I love praying now. I pray day in, day out. I'm saying, God, for me, why is a girl of prayer to you so hard? You really make me go through this. You really make me push out a baby. God, you really make me push out a baby. And baby, just come on. Right now, God, me not believe in you. Of course. I'm telling you what worse to kill me. When I'm busted by them, she says, a boy, you know what? Damn, it's a boy. I'm numb. Numb, 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 numb. Numb, it was a baby boy. Dead stop. This is a baby nugget. Nothing for me. Damn. No, I don't say God knows best enough. But I tell you how I really feel at that time. At that time, I didn't believe in God, but I know that God bring me through it because it's nobody else but Him bring me through all that pain and me nearly dead through. It was a boy. Um, it killed me, you know, I think for God for it. But I'm grateful for them because I put you God in my real arm for our boy. You know what I'm saying? Put you upon this, that this killed me in a real arm. The boy, God, you know? I really the boy got take that take the boy take him take him take him. I mean, my phone I'm gonna stop ball. I could hold my baby. You think that me? You think that means I'm a bad person? I could hold him. He's like, me never know what did that to me. Me never want to hold him. Me never want to know. I just feel depressed like one. I see the depression just at the same time, instant. Yeah. I mean, I say, what can I feel in this? Why do I want to my baby? Why do I want to my baby? Why do I want to give my baby? I'm sorry. Because my father, I should have no say for us. I should have done work. But my foot right through. I strain you. Never know if I strain my own. I start thinking all kinds of things. My mind start. I'm, I'm telling you, this am an overthinker. You believe me? Then at the hospital and I'm not to 
natin kung okay, baby. I mean, so far God, it don't mean that it's a bad person. I just feel depressed. But I make sure my mother and my father are the But I tell the baby, the stamp on the baby father, the baby get nothing for me. No, mm, no, my nose, no more color, no more shape, no. Mm. Everything for your father, not for me. But then in the hospital, and they make sure it's all right before I come out. But let me tell you this you see in your life, Listen you up. have friends, Listen up. and you have real friends. You have family, and you have real family. You believe me? It's a my friend them. It's the especially Rene and Pucci. To the end here. Now so now tell me I tell you. To the end, like Chucky and that I come from Marty. So I'm not even a recite Marty, but anyway, they at this it I come from. Pucci and Rene them they make me feel. They not give me no time. They don't give me no time for going on a deep, deep depression like you want to kill yourself. Right through them, come right through them, take no whole time them come to the hospital. It's my baby father. Right through the man that ease up the man that feel up on my side. It's my mother and my sister. Them. You believe me? It's my mother and my sister. Them. Yeah, so when I go through things like this, I need really people around here. Come in two seconds from mad out and out of rubbish. I mean, I tell you, because I know me a real girl, you keep it real, you know. Two seconds yeah. from mad out of rubbish. Mad out. Be your thing, I think I'm here. Sad, depressed, no one got work, no one's on my phone, no one talk to nobody, nobody. But I want to know that every day when I don't want to talk to my friend, them, I will get a, a text from my phone where I will make me feel a little bit lighter but they know I don't want to talk. Yeah. But they don't ease up. You believe me? My mother, my sister, them, my friend, them, my baby father can't show this here. And father God, even though I never believe in him at the time, and my big sister for him, I text my sister for him and I say, sis, I got you in a real state where I can't come out of my depression. And she said, I must post, post some posts up, I got you. I'm sad, I can't see the happiness. Who is part of the depression? I'm going to start building my mother's house and I'm coming like I can't even do that. I'm going to build my mother's house and I'm going to build it up. I'm up in the sky, tall, 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 tall. And not even that, I can't think for the way I should have think for the to come, I should have to say, I can buy my mother's house based on the fact that she has struggled with her picking them all these years. And not even that, I could even think, oh. Sad. I get up one night, take up the bleach, and I go drink the bleach. I'm coming out from being father. And the bleach in my hand. That's what the prism was. I take up the bleach and I go drink the bleach car. God could love me through my disguise. So me did start love my baby in a deep. I'm coming out of the room and I say, I'm looking for my look for my look for my baby father. I'm saying, I can't do him this. You know? Because the man will really love me, you know? I mean, today is enough. No, a man, not 30 years, not 20 years, they love you. A man can just come in your life, no, I love you. I'm going to take up the bleach, so I'm going to drink it. I'm going to come in the room, so I'm going to look at him one last time. But it's like a god, so I'm going to look at him. Because maybe if I never look at him, I'm going to drink it. I'm going to tell my mother and my sister then this. I just my big sister alone, I'm going to tell her. Come in and look at him, I'm going to say, no, I'm going to do it. It's going to kill him. I take up my phone and I look at my sister and my mother and I say, you know, I'm not it. It will kill them. 
God them love me. Deep. I just wake up my baby father. I tell him to say, I never drink the bleach. And I chum up on him, I never do it. And I take the back from me and we start crying together. But, I'm going to tell you this. Postmortem, postpartum depression, real. And my, the reason why it took me so hard was because when I did in the hospital, the people them asked me if I wanted um, counseling. And I said no. Because you know, I was thinking that I'm so strong, I could just easily come out of the hospital and get over it. Easy, easy, easy. Like I'm nothing. Because means like I'm strong, but it burnt me. But I'm telling you this, we're not too big for that counseling, yeah? I'm going to take the counseling because for come home, come I write to my friends, I'm telling them, I'm going to put your text and she's a friend. I'm going to do it. Because if you're going to get something to take yourself for your mind, that matter. Then by yourself, I know the man, but I'm going to tell the man to tell me because I know the man to tell me because I know the man to tell me. But I am what? Seven weeks? Eight weeks? Huh? Eight weeks. Oh, Poochie, there are Poochie. What's up, baby? I don't know. I don't feel that like I can pray, but I want to pray. I mean, my sister said, I'm going to pray to pray for me. But my belief, I start praying for myself. Some of the share my journey with you because I know I always keep it 100. And please don't turn this into please and thanks. But guys, I just want to tell you thanks for all the love you want to show me. For the most part, my life and I don't know it never turned out over the plot. And sometimes when I don't see people on Instagram. Alright. <clears throat> so um So, I don't know if I don't like what she do, what she talk about. The thing them, the butt, the butt shots them what she do, see? And maybe you can't find, but it's, a, it's an interesting story. I mean, the one going to the whole journey of how she lose the baby. And why she lose the baby, according to her. The butt shots them what she do, do. They travel to our cervix. And at them, basically, they, 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 um, the, the, the silicone something them, whatever them, whatever them is, what they inject on them bottom. And that travel to our cervix, you know. Yep. I can't see what she said the doctor tell her. Mm hmm. And that travel to our cervix and, and mash up the baby. So, just like we an idea of the risk where the, where the woman them are run with, with doing them butt shots there and, and them something there. But at the end of the day, people, we know everybody right now, everybody right now, why them body look like Dolly. But as a sister Sherry, you know, she said, I couldn't know, you know said it comes with a lot of risk and here she said she got through postpartum depression she almost commit suicide she have to pay she have to pay thirteen thousand dollars to remove the, the butt shots them and them travel all over her body see and see them end up go, 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 go log in her lodge in her um in her cervix see those are the ones that the doctor in Colombia she said couldn't couldn't move, right? Those are the ones she said the doctor doctor couldn't move. The doctor them couldn't move. You see? I wish me did find a part to explain a part the two. No? You see me I say? 
Or me can't, me, 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 So, I know the ladies them want the body look like Dolly. And I know the man them when I forgot prep when I forgot have enough money. When I forgot have enough money because it's not cheap. The butt plug them are for thousand dollars, but a lot of women they do the butt, butt plug them, you have to go fix up back some of them body now. For put in them the, 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 the for replace the butt plugs them. Come remember them can't just take out the butt plugs them. The one that was still in the bottom, then can't just take out that bottom. Those ones can't just come out, you know. And they replace with something, you know. They have to replace with something, they have to cut off the bottom. You see what I say? She named, she named Dancer Queen Sher Hannibal. Dancer Queen Sher, she named. Beautiful, beautiful sister. The first time I meet that girl, she never need nothing to do nothing to her body. The first time I meet that girl, that girl had all the music video, you know, in my music video, then. I swear, dance as Queen Cher. Yeah, much. I think she in have one of my, or two of my music videos. Them, them girls never need to do nothing to them body, you know. Them girls did well, hot and look good, and them body look good and everything. But of course, everybody, have, as she said, big bottom did a wear. So, it boils down to this. Everybody right now, um, I the new thing, everybody want to look like a dolly. Everybody have to take out them belly. Everybody have put it on them bottom and all them things there woman a compete with man man a do it woman a do it man a walk around with big old body you can't believe there's a man that a walk around hips and everything a swing because the woman them having the 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 the, 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 the butt implants or the butt something them chewed because you can identify and say oh that girl that girl the body no real can't nah move it can't shake because once them start pumping in the body them body can't really move it becomes stiff yeah so all in all just have no money all in all have no money you see what I say me see all golly back one she now, me see she fix up for her body and proud of it too, but here we go on. If you don't have the money when it needs to fix up back, you know. Because enough, here we go on now, you know, people. Here we go on, you know. Enough man go lose them woman too. Because man go come and can't fix them body where you can't fix. Because it costs a lot of money if it fix the body. So, them, them time there when she had talked about this, you know, that was a long time ago. And it was 13,000 US dollars. So now you know it's about 20, 30,000 dollars to do it. So forget the perfect body. Enough man are going to lose them woman to a, to a man who can't give them the perfect body. But you see, when them and them, when them, when them, and them and they left, they have to go find another rich man or another man who have money. And when them and them and they left, them woman they can't pop down again, you know. And they can't go there with no little broke pocket man again. Because if them dead a broke pocket man, when the body need to do over, what them I go do? What them I go do when them need to do over them body? 